Hey guys, and welcome back to part three of Let's Play The Sims 3 Island Paradise. Um, Kenny is actually getting up now because he is nauseous again, at, well, seasick again. And I don't get it because he's got the sailor trait, and she's never gotten that, so that's definitely weird. Um... Yeah, and since he's up, we're going to go ahead and have him take care of the space rock and get the um, ruby cut. And I forgot last night that I needed to put away the food. So I'm going to put this in his refrigerator. And hopefully he'll be able to make something good for breakfast. He can only make waffles. Why can't he make anything else? That's getting really annoying. Alright, so he's gonna have to... Why are you sick again? Alright, and she is still sleeping, but she does have to work in four hours, so she's gonna have to get up pretty soon. Um... She's not even close to being done sleeping. And the sharks just keep popping up. Which is kind of very scary. Um, Alright. He wants to make the bed. Well, we could do that. Um, what's your space rock worth? $43? Let's sell that thing. Alright. And we're going to hang up their diplomas. Because they really don't need them in their inventory. So let's go ahead and do that. Uh, we're going to sell the newspaper just because we don't need it anymore. We sh someday we'll probably own that. And now she's seasick. Oh, jeez. You guys make the worst people living on a houseboat, okay? Seriously. All right. So, Hobart's Hideaway made $203. You know, we haven't even went to see this place. And it says, Space Rock looks to be unusual. Core Taurus Gaza site worth around $43. All right. And I keep seeing sharks in the background. Look at them all. They need to go away. I get so scared that they're going to eat me. Okay. Seriously, get up. <laughs> You're taking too long in bed. <clears throat> all right. Three more hours. And she's going to be sick in an hour. So she might as well come downstairs, get a seat. And wait for him to finish cooking this meal. Which hopefully doesn't take forever. Which I think it's going to actually. There she is. Alright. I didn't see any like cracking or anything. Because I know sometimes you can. That it'll come up underneath your boat while you're sleeping. And the summer festival has arrived in town. Join your friends for long days packed with excitement under the warm sun. Come hungry for hot dogs and snow cones. They get ready to burn calories in the skating rink or play a game of soccer. Maybe you'll just grab a spray tan and relax as fireworks fill the evening sky. Whatever you choose, it's sure to be a great time. All right. So he actually did that. He wants to clean dishes. And I think we're going to have that done before we get a three-star resort. So let's go ahead and get her. No, you're not making a... Dinkin' snow cone. Let's go ahead and get her to grab a plate and then put away the leftovers. Um, someone else got a job. Okay, now she's eating a stupid snow cone. Ugh. Alright, when he's done, since he doesn't have a job, because his job is taking care of the resort, um, we're going to have him <laughs> go take care of the resort. I was going to have him snorkel, but I saw the shark and I freaked. Alright, seriously, you really need to hurry this up. Two more hours, huh? Okay. Let's get you to eat some waffles. I don't know why the snow cone didn't do what it was supposed to do. It was supposed to fill her hungry, but it didn't. Um, yeah, let's head on over to the resort when he's done. He's actually really tired still. Um, let's see. A sale has started at the groceries and diner store. And... Let's go see this resort. I don't... We don't have very much money. Um... But... This place 
is here. Let's get him to set resort stay pricing, close the resort, manage the crew. Um, res view the resort finances. Well, we could do that. We are full. Um, front desk. Um, hire a new employee for the front desk. No, we don't want to do that. Set shifts. We'll only do daytime. Why not? Actually, we could just take it off. And... I think we can run it, but I'm not sure. Um, we could actually just... For right now, since we don't have a lot of money... It just seems smarter to um, to have it where, wow, spit it out, where we take care of most of everything. So hire new employees, no. Stay, no, that's not what we want to do. Manage maintenance crew. Zero. All right. Um, set the food type. Um, what is it set at? Lunch. Let's go ahead and do. I don't know. Let's see, I don't know what I'm doing here. <laughs> All right. Let's go ahead and visit Hobart's Hideaway. Look at all the sharks out there. Dang. They're ready. Oh my god. Two more just popped up. I just seen it. Look at There's like four of them. <gasps> so many. Okay. She's actually going to need to get to her work. So I need to find out where she works. I th we were docked here. So I think she works here. So we're going to have her go visit there when she's done. And he is in his taxi. He is in his boat taxi. And he's happy about it too. He's got the sailor mood, sailing mood lit again. Which is fine with me. Alright. Let's go ahead and see. Um, somebody became a firefighter. This is Hobart's hideaway, I do believe. And we're going to just zoom on down here. Alright, so as you can see, this is Hobart's hideaway. There's people already here. Not a lot of people, but that's okay. There is an all-in-one bathroom. These are the rooms that you can stay in. Um, you can freshen up. Um, turn in for the night, um, upgrade, and all that. There is some stuff out here to d that they can use, but not too much. Um, let's go ahead and have him operate the front desk because he is the resort manager and he needs to uh, take care of his take care of his uh, his resort check in. Check in with resort management, cool. set shifts, cool. hire new employees, Good. create customs, assign resort uniform, and operate the front desk, which he's obviously operating it already. Um, she should already have been at work by now. So someone's late for work. Um, she got a new job. All right, let's go ahead and allow her to survey the beach. Uh, yeah, this button's not working. Um, 
Why is she not? Stop relaxing, please. Where the heck is she? Stop relaxing. Get up. Oh, jeez. Um, he saw a ghost? Well, that's weird. Um, can you please get up off of this thing? Whatever it is. And do your job. Okay, I don't know why I can't choose this. It's really getting on my nerves. Is it not time for her to work yet? It says on the clock. Alright, I don't know what's going on. But I can't choose for her to survey the beach. Um, no, we're not playing in the ocean. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. I've seen other people using this interaction. I never saw them get the pop-up thing for it, but I did see them click from in the map tag on it. And it's not working for some odd reason. It's wanting to be difficult. Um... I don't know of any other way to get her to actually do this. I know she is supposed to watch for if someone starts to drown. And she does have someone going in right now. Okay. Uh, oh. Lips, sir. Oh. No. We're not water ballooning fight. Alright, he's still managing the front desk. Um, it is his job, so he kind of does need to do it. This is really getting on my nerves that... That I can't choose perform job. So I don't really know how to do it. Maybe now that I've X that out, I can choose it from the map view. No, it still doesn't let me. That is so weird. Um Yeah, I don't know what to do. Uh, I guess she just I just I just stay here with her. Because she is here until six, so anything could happen. <laughs> Play in the ocean. I don't even know what that means. And now it's gone. Okay. Um. Hopefully this person doesn't drown. I think they're okay. I don't think they're drowning. But we got someone going in over there. I don't know. I don't know why it's not working. Um, person, what are you going to do? <laughs> That's mean. Oh, no. No, we're not playing water balloon fight. Alright, come on. S sit in this chair. Uh -huh. Rude. I don't know Rude. if sitting in a chair helps or not, but we can certainly try. Alright, so let's see. I don't know. I have no idea why this is not working. It's really kind of aggravating, but you should be able to choose something for them to do while they just sit here. Come on. Yeah, I don't know. I don't see anyone drowning, so I think that's okay. It just bothers me that I can't choose this. Hmm. Is 
Is she pregnant? Um. What is she gonna do? Swim around? That girl definitely looks pregnant. Is that a shark? Oh no, it's, that's a fish. Be chatted to. I love how this person's got an umbrella up and it's not even, it's not even touching them. The shade is not, you only touching their head. Yeah, that makes a lot of sense. Love is blooming between Akoni Kahal and Marissa Lod. The new couple were out of town recently, arm in arm, enjoying each other's company. All right. She's definitely got to be pregnant. If you look at her, she's got a little baby bump already. Right there. So she's definitely expecting a baby. Which is very Ajinka cute. Be bizarre. Ah, Chala. Come on. All right. Well, nothing really exciting is happening here. He is still managing this desk. He is exhausted. All right. Um. Yeah, this is going to be a killer. Um, he is just kind of standing here, not doing too much. Um, there is a suite here, but nothing's really happening. And what's upstairs? Nothing really. And you have to have 5,000 to upgrade this, and I don't have that much. So I can't upgrade. I was just going to see who that was, and then they ran away. It's Minnie Moose. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. It's almost like Minnie Mouse, but Minnie Moose. Um, okay. He needs to, like, take a nap or something. <laughs> All right, some Sims just are not punctual. Apparently, Tanner York is late for his job. Albert is being extra lazy today. All right, so it tells the pet immigration, the partner, the new flirts, all that kind of stuff. Um, Doug Rodel and Valerie Idol Vital are getting all hot and heavy for each other. Okay, and. When he is done with his nap, he needs to operate the front desk again. She wants to upgrade a resort tower. Yeah, well, sounds like a good day, but you're supposed to be worrying about your job. Oh, jeez. Someone's going in right now. All right. Please do not drown. How about you go ahead and take a nap? He is still taking a nap. And it's getting bad. Buy a pool waterfall for your resort. That would be nice. But uh, he has to buy a pool water slide for the resort too. Yeah, well. Uh oh. I think she's drowning. Okay, we need to rescue her. Please hurry. This is not the pregnant woman, is it? <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Is she coming? Yeah, here she comes. Hopefully she gets there in time. Had to pick her up. Beam. She just was so darn cute. I cannot pass her up. Okay. Will you hurry it up? You're taking forever. This girl's gonna drown. Oh, jeez. We got two people drowning. How am I supposed to save both? I just choose one or the other, and then choose to rescue the other. Hopefully, they don't drown. All right. 
He's gonna drown. Go rescue him. She's fine. She's got the little floaty float float thing. See that? She's all better. <laughs> She's all better. All right. Rescue this person. Hurry up. All right. Is she going to die now? Because we stopped rescuing her. I don't know. I think she's okay. Yeah, she's okay. No worries. Who is this? Harley Greenwood. Alright, buddy. What do we got to do with you? Still got to rescue him? How? He's... Walking. How are you going to rescue him? He's walking. Oh, jeez. Oh, Give him CPR. Hurry. Just, yep, just stand there. Yep, that's a good idea. <laughs> She's giving him CPR. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> She's not even on work anymore. She gets off at 6, and she's still taking care of this. Is he dead? Uh-huh. She's feeling for a pulse. <laughs> oh geez, there's a baby here. Where? Oh look, he's all better. We saved him. Look, there's a baby. Michael Han. Let's go ahead and give him a friendly introduction. He's gonna thank her. That's nice. You saved me. How can I repay you? Um. <laughs> We're just going to ask if he's single. Mm -hmm. All right. He just saw another ghost. She learned that he's a Leo. Alright, buddy. Alright, so we know a guy named Harley Greenwood now. Alright, we're going to jump over to this guy. Jenny learned that Harley is single. Alright. Let's go ahead and... And let's see, 153 of 100 and, all right, we're going to have to set the shifts for these two. All right, and then he'll do the other one so he can go home now. Actually, you know what? Before he goes home, he really needs to use the bathroom. Are these people going to check in and we just left? Yeah, I th Close think we did. Alright, come on. We're not going home, I said. <laughs> oh my gosh. We just lost a person. <laughs> Will you use this darn bathroom? Alright, come on. She's still talking with somebody. Alright, who is this? Edward Dreg? I don't even know who that is. I don't know who any of these people are, I don't think. Looks like I don't have access to this VIP area. What? Okay. Now he's stinky. Alright. I think this is the girl that works for us, so we're going to go on home. He couldn't hold any longer and had a regretful bladder accident. Well, that sounds horrible. <laughs> I certainly wouldn't want to pee myself. Alright. He's actually in green now? Wow. Alright, what are you doing? What are you being? What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Who are you talking to? I thought you were talking to a girl. I don't want you talking to... Or I thought you were talking to a guy, not a girl. No, we're not going to listen to you. Whatever you're going to tell us, we really don't care. 
All right, so we are having her go home. Hopefully this is more successful than the last time we tried to get back on the houseboat. I'm hoping anyways. Um, she's actually met a couple of people. She met Harley Greenwood, um, Persephone Han, Honey Hamada, Barrett Diaz, Leandro La Rosa and Craig Foster. He has met one person and their name is Barrett Diaz. And I'm pretty sure if I'm right, that was the mascot. <laughs> so he didn't really meet anyone. Um, let's go ahead and have some waffles. He can go ahead and use the bathroom and then he can go ahead and go to sleep. She needs to do pretty much the same thing. Um, she needs to eat some waffles, use the bathroom, and then go ahead and sleep. Oh, Norkel! All right, so they're both here, and Honey has just completed her athletic skill to level six. Christopher is now the father of a new baby boy. Rose Marie just gave birth to a baby boy named Francis. Well, that's nice. Alright, so he is very stinky. Alright, come on. By the time she's done, he's going to be done. And then they're both going to try and get into this one little bathroom and it's not going to work. Oh, jeez. Now he's cleaning up. Oh, gosh. Alright. And she's going to clean up as well. And they are actually friends, so that is a good thing. Hurry up and use this bathroom. Because she's going to want to use it and you're going to be in her way. Oh my god. This is that thing. Oh! Look how big it is. Can you like do something with it? Oh my god, it's huge. Oh man, it's even scarier than before. Use the bathroom, please. And then you may go to sleep, be douche. All right, he is on his way upstairs. It's already midnight. Oh my gosh, where did time go? All right, and he is climbing into bed. Those are quite. I swear, he's not wearing anything that I gave him to wear. I don't understand why. Anyways, she is supposed to be on her way up here. Yeah, she is. Alright, come on. I bet you we have bills that we should have paid. Let's go ahead and get him to pay them when he gets up. And there's also mail, so let's get him to get the mail when he gets up too. Alright, so I am going to come back when oh my god I'm going to come back when they're awake and I'll see you in a little bit okay so I have woken up Kenny because he needs to go to his the resort and take care of the front desk um Ginny doesn't have to actually get up at a certain time today because she doesn't have to work. So that's not a big deal. Um, I did put make sure I put a couple windows in here for some sunlight. And I covered the outside. I also had forgotten to put on a roof. So they were just living in there with no roof. Um, but I did add that now. So that's not a problem. 
When Ginny gets up, let's go ahead and have her read the newspaper and check the weather. And we're going to have her work on some snorkeling some more. Um, he received his emerald cut ruby from the gem cutter. All right. He is off to the resort. He wants to bathe. Well, we could do that. Um, the emerald cut ruby is worth 38 bucks, so we're going to sell that. And we didn't have enough to pay the bills, so we are going to have to pay them next time. We're going to follow Kenny on over to the resort just because um, it's not really fun to watch someone to sleep. Hey, can we ride that? <laughs> no, we can't. What are we doing? All right, this is not the resort. I have no idea why we're stopping here, but we'll have to wait and see. All right. I think he has to catch a taxi now, which would be really annoying, and he does. All right. Well, hopefully he's almost there. It is 68 degrees out right now here, and there's only 26 days left until fall. So it's going to start getting kind of chilly here pretty soon. And it looks like he needs to make sure he cleans up some of the stuff. Actually, those are really cute. All right, he is going to manage the front desk and... Let's see. As you can see, there is garbage here, I think, that needs to be cleaned up. But I'm not really sure what it is. There's garbage here that needs to be cleaned up. He definitely needs to clean that up. Um, hopefully the office can cope without Cynthia McGuire for another hour. She appears to be in no rush to get there. Okay. And what is this person doing? Dumpster diving? How gross. <laughs> That is gross. All right. Please clean that up. And this is... He needs to clean that. If you can see it, it's disgusting. Okay, just look at that. Look at how gross that is. That is disgusting. All right. So he's going to take care of that. Don't really know why he's got to close the door to clean it, but okay. Um, let's see. Um, this toilet is clogged, so he needs to unclog that. And there's that lady who's pregnant again. And then he needs to operate the front desk. I think everything else is pretty much okay. What is out for food? I don't even know what's out. This food is disgusting. Why would we be feeding somebody nasty food? I don't even know what it is. This is cheesesteak. This is grilled cheese. These are hamburgers. And these are stew surprise. And half of it is disgusting. That is gross. Okay, so he's going to come on in here. And this sink is dirty too. Oh, jeez. He might as well clean it before he operates the front desk. Launch, launch. He just saw Roxy's photo at the agency and had to pick her up. Beamed Ray Matsuri. She was just so darn cuddly. I could not pass her up. Excellent. Expectant parents, Festivus Phone Han and Devin Han, have seen been seen out shopping for baby supplies yesterday. Oh. 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 All right. Hopefully he's going to... Can they actually bathe in this? They really can? That is so weird. Um, he's actually taking care of his own place, so that's okay. Um, we only have $98. Um, there are like two pregnancies. Partnered, existing friends, unexpected pregnancy, old flirt, shotgun marriage, <laughs> um, move in. Oh yeah, speaking of, I want to change, I think it's story progression, and I don't want this to be like this, I want it to be the husband's name. 
and then for the same sex you could just do a coin flip and that would be fine with me um i think it chooses it no you have to do it for every one oh my gosh all right well let's go ahead and do that quickly since it needs to be done because we're getting hyphenated names and it's not going to work well if it's hyphenated um I, that's not the issue alright that's good so that works and um they're out shopping for baby supplies. After having a little too much fun in the bedroom, they appear to be happy, though, going on about their new pregnancy. Um, it just tells me that I changed the things that I did. Um, they just perk up an otherwise jury day side and onlooker watching Marissa Ladd and Akani Kahal stroll down the sidewalk. All right. Reefney, Trebi Zab, Rebevney. He's getting actually hungry. And she's actually up now. So we're going to quickly jump on over to her. Just because he's just managing the front desk. She's actually eating a snow cone. Her and those snow cones are best friends. Um, what does that say? Laid back lemon. Ah, uh, what is it about the cool tang of a lemon snow cone that seems to make all the stress just melt away? And that's from eating a snow cone. Alright, you're not going to read anything. You're actually going to come out here. And you're going to snorkel. It's talk of a town with a cookie marriage between Marissa Ladkahal and Akoni Ladkahal to make their new baby legal. Yeah, see, that their names are hyphenated now, which is really annoying. And they swim right through the boat. Nice. They swim right through the house. All right, so yeah, he's just working on his resort. He's going to need to eat something here pretty soon. But for right now, he's okay. Um, they moved in together now. Wow. Um, all right. So she is going to be snorkeling. I'm hoping she's going to get up that skill. She's actually got two athletic. Wow. Um, what does she want to do? Find an object while snorkeling. Uh, actually, we're going to accept that. Um, learn the social networking, buy a dartboard. Yeah, we're not going to do any of that stuff. Um, we're just pretty much going to stay here with her just because we ain't really got much other to do. Um, somebody else is late for work. We really don't care. Who's this? Christopher Collins. Looks like he is going to be snorkeling maybe but he's not really doing much no nope, i think he's scuba diving yeah he's scuba diving and he's probably gonna scare me when he comes back up but that's okay um oh she found something thanks to Janice eagle eye she found a magnificent crawly ca cowrie shell wow Smooth and round, the cowrie shell turns every beach into an egg hunt. All right. I'm not really sure what you're supposed to do with all these things, but that's fine with me. All right. So he is just manning the front desk still. Getting pretty hungry, but that's okay. Um, uh, go snorkeling in the ocean. Sure, that's what you're already doing, so that's pretty easy. Uh, she's gained enough lifetime points to purchase a reward. Okay. Um, she's grabbed the basics of scuba diving. She'll always remember that moment where it all started to come together. And the message of that is always the same. But this says, Jitty is ready to begin her underwater adventure, exploring the de deep depths of the ocean floor. Jenny can continue building on this skill by snorkeling or scuba diving. All right, so I'm pretty sure now we can go underwater, which is pretty exciting. I'm excited about this. Um, so let's go ahead and see if we can choose for her to scuba dive. Which, if you click on this, the area is too dangerous to dive in. Try increasing your scuba diving skill first. Is there other scuba diving s 
spots though like other spots to go scuba diving at can she go scuba diving here still says it's too dangerous too dangerous well that's kind of annoying so she's pretty much just got to start keeps um snorkeling for right now which that's okay we'll get underwater sometime or another she can go windsurfing I don't know how she doesn't have a windsurf but okay um he's actually getting extremely hungry Woo! <laughs> I do not like the sharks or the kraken those two things are not my favorites alright yeah go back down into the depths of the water go snorkeling it's time to get both your feet and head wet out at sea your sim would like to go snorkeling in the ocean which she's already doing so that's kind of different um I wanted to see how many points they get for these he actually gets more than she does which that's fine um let's see what are you she's only got 5,000 points so not too much but we could always look um let's see professional slacker yeah I don't think so um I was gonna see if there was any new ones that we could get but I don't see any new ones um there probably is but just not yet we can't get any yet which is fine Alright, he's still doing the front desk, huh? I don't even know. That's just his job, is to take care of the resort. Um, yeah. She's just having a good old time out here. I don't even know where she is. Oh, she's pretty close to it. Um, I don't It's about 66 degrees out. Seriously, it looks a lot hotter than that. All right, we might have to jump over to him and get him to eat something. She's just swimming around anyways in the ocean. Where's our house? Oh, <laughs> I thought we were closer than that, but I think it might be drifting away because I don't know how to drop anchor or maybe it doesn't drift at all. I don't know. Anyways, so she is working on her skill. Let's go ahead and just jump right on over to him quickly. We're going to get him something to eat because he is very, very hungry. All right. Are you going to take any of these people in? Uh, Harley Greenwood and Lapota Alto have begun dating. Both have been remarking to friends about how the other completes them. Well, I guess that guy's out of the question now, isn't he? Alright. Can we, like, we can't choose to, like, check anyone in anyways, so it doesn't really matter. So let's go ahead and the cheesecake and the spoiled. Can we, like, choose something else? Set food quality. I really think we should do medium. Just because. Darn. Just because it's so. L the low is disgusting. People don't want to eat that. Alright. So he is going to go grab something to eat. Then he shall come right on in. I bet you these have certain ones for certain genders. Yeah. He might as well come do that. And then he can operate the front desk some more. We're going to jump on over to her since she's still just snorkeling. And hopefully close to a level two. And look, there's some people out here. Their names are Doug Rodell and Laura La Rosa. And they're splashing each other on a normal day. <laughs> a normal day in Isla Paradiso. All right. Oh, jeez. No, I don't want to be splashed, thanks. I'm working on something else. But you can go splash her if you want. Not me. 
Alright, come on. It's seriousness. This skill level had better go up here pretty soon. It's taking you forever to get this skill level. Boat's gonna hit us. The boat's gonna hit us. <laughs> oh, wait. I think she just got another level. And she has. She can now scuba dive at Rocky Reef. And that's exactly where we are. <gasps> Alright. I'm going to save quickly just because I don't want to lose anything. She wants to actually go scuba diving. Alright. I'm going to save quickly and then I'm going to allow her to scuba dive under, or scuba dive here, since she can. Hopefully this doesn't take forever. Saving, saving, saving. All right, it didn't take too long. All right, let's go ahead and allow her to scuba dive. This is gonna be pretty exciting. Can you stop snorkeling now and start scuba diving? He is actually in a much better mood. Grab a plate of cheese steak. Why are you going to grab more food? You're already full. Stop scuba diving. Or er, stop snorkeling. Go scuba diving. Oh wait, I think she found something. Ginny's snorkeling led her to find the crawly shell. Which, she already found one of those. So now she's got two of them. Alright, seriously? Can you please just scuba dive now? We don't want to watch you snorkel anymore. We've seen enough. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Come on. I think that person just ran over that other person. <laughs> oh, jeez. That poor person's going to have a major headache. It just got a boat to the head. <laughs> All right. She is going to go scuba dive, I do believe. Yeah, she is. Alright, here we go. Go. <laughs> Alright. Nope, here we go. Oh, wow. Warm wetsuit. The sudden underwater scare has given your sim a warm and uncomfortable, an uncomfortable feeling. Okay. Why did she pee herself? I don't think I want to know why she peed herself. I I honestly don't. Seriously don't want to know. Alright, so this is amazing. This is really exciting. Okay. Go ahead. I don't know why you peed yourself. From seeing a shark? What's this say? Breathing comfortably. Alright. Uh, catch a fish while diving. Your sim wants to go scuba diving and catch a fish. Well, heck, let's catch a fish. Since she wants to do it. And that is disgusting. I think that's her pea cloud. Which is really gross. Alright. The sounds are amazing. Of her breathing and everything. It's just so cool. Alright, catch it. Oh yeah. What does she want to do with it now? She wants to catch five. Wow. She really wants to catch some fish. Alright. Well, I wanted to find some treasure. <laughs> I wanted to do something cool down here. Not just catch fish. But I guess we can catch fish. Go ahead and catch this one. You might as well catch this one. She's caught an alley catfish worth $12. Nice. I wondered if we could catch fish when we were down here, and that answers my question. That's exciting. Uh-oh. She's hungry. I think we'll be okay, though. Who's that? I don't... I don't 
see anyone, which is kind of freaky, just to see their shadow. She caught a sea urchin worth $14, which is cool. All right, so there's a jellyfish there, and we really need something to eat, but we just got down here. Um, I'm not really sure how far these go or how big they are, which it's kind of hard to navigate them with all this big stuff in your way. Ugh. All right, what's she doing? She wants to view that. Um, okay, go ahead and do that, girl. Um, there's got to be something to do down here. There's got to be a reason you come down here, other than catching fish. Seriously, that would be boring. Um, she caught a jellyfish worth thirteen dollars. Okay, I think. Uh oh. Depressurizing? I don't even know what that means. <laughs> Your sim needs to depressurize before diving again. Try again later. Well, that's upsetting because I was having fun down there. All right. Let's go ahead and choose for her to get something to eat at home. Put down the walls. Thank you. Eat some waffles. And he is managing that desk again. So let's go ahead and jump on over to him. Seems a good catch. All right. So their relationship. All right, what is going on here? I thought we had someone else running this desk, but I don't see no one doing it. All right, stop, stop manning the desk and see if someone else comes. Go here. There is no attendant available to help you at the moment. Ew. Um, okay. And he's feeling sick. Sleep? No, we're not sleeping oh. here. You have a house to go to. Oh, so he could sleep here if we really wanted him to. Uh, what's freshen up? I don't even know what that means. I mean, I know what it means, but I don't know what it means for the Sims. All right, so someone's aged up into a teen already. Wow. Okay. So, he's in there. He's now a father of a new baby boy. Honey just gave birth to a baby boy named Hector. Aww. So, freshening up means you put up all your hunger, your bladder, your energy, your hygiene. Pretty much all of it, which is really exciting. And I don't think she can get in the houseboat again. Which is very obnoxious that she can't get in here. Please can we eat leftovers? Oh my gosh. Go here. Is something in her way? Maybe I need to get rid of this thing. And see if that helps. Alright. Please go here now. No, it's still not working. I don't get it. Go here. Go here. Eat leftover waffles. I really don't know what's going on. Or why she can't get anywhere. Alright. Well, since she has to work tomorrow, we might as well just send her on over here and have her stay here as well. So let's go ahead and allow her to freshen up. Go. Alright. And he is just about done. His energy isn't too high, but turn in for the night. That's kind of funny. Um, but 
We'll have them just do the same stuff and just in Actually, can she use this one too? Oh wow, look at that. Alright, well anyways. Um, let me tell you how much I love seeing those two together. They just perk up an otherwise dreary day. Okay. I don't know where he's coming from. They have a new child on the way. Wow, people are just popping out babies left and right here. Alright. Where is she going? I have no idea. Alright. Oh, so there's a back door as well. What is that? These are kind of cool. Alright. Well, while they're just doing their thing, you know... I'm just going to sit here and watch her. This is actually where I'm going to end this video for today. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please leave a thumbs up, a like, a comment. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.